Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for watching. Today I'm going to play around with some Tower 28 products, which is a brand that's brand new to me. So if you want to see how I came up with this look and my first impression on the brand, then just keep watching. Starting right off, I'm going to spritz my skin with the Save Our Skin Daily Rescue Facial Spray. I already have foundation and concealer on here, so I'm kind of just refreshing it and getting prepared for the next product, which is the Bronzino, the cream bronzer. I have here the shade West Coast, which claims to be a medium bronze with neutral undertones. Um, the product does say that it's a buildable illuminating cream bronzer for that effortless summer glow from within. You apply it by tapping on wherever the sun naturally shines on your face and buff buff blend to add warmth and dimension. Bronzino is multi-purpose so you can try it on eyes and lips for an easy wash of color. As you can see here I did apply the product first and now I am using a Real Techniques buffer brush to blend the product out. Um, it is very sheer and very balmy. I would have to try the product out more to give it more of a fair chance, I'd say, because my first impression of it, um, I didn't feel like it added much warmth or any color at all to my skin. It was very sheer, like it does claim to be, but I just wish that it had a little bit more pigment to give me more of a bronze effect. Once I applied the cream bronzer to the tip of my nose and around my forehead, I did like the product a little bit better. Next time I use it, I will probably just stick to adding the product on those areas because it did start to add that sun-kissed, more toasty look you'd get when you were out in the sun. So this I did like on the forehead, it gave a really sheer, warm, tan effect to my skin and it was very subtle. I really like that. Um, I also did really, really like it as an eyeshadow. If you just put a little bit on your finger and sheer out the product even more, you'll get a nice tint of color, which I enjoyed. So I will definitely use the product for uh, maybe a cream eyeshadow next time and a little bit of a tint on my skin. Next product I use from Tower 28 is the Beach Please Luminous Tinted Balm in Magic Hour. This color is described as a sun-kissed rosy nude and it is just that. Um, it says that you can apply it for your cheeks and lips, just tap tap blend and layer for bolder color. This product is described as a multi-purpose tinted balm that blends seamlessly for a natural luminous finish. No cakiness, no harsh lines, just beautiful sun-kissed skin. So in my opinion, this product did settle down as more of a powder finish, which surprised me. But I do love it because you can definitely build it up and not worry about it getting too creamy and moving around throughout the day. Next up is the Super Dew Highlighter Balm. Now, if you are not a dewy, glossy, glassy lover, then you are not going to appreciate this product. 
It is a Super Dew Translucent Complexion Boosting Highlighting Balm. No shimmer, no glitter, no daytime disco, just glassy, luminous skin. So if you're a makeup lover, then you know there is many products on the market just like this one. I have tried a few of them, but I have to say this is probably my favorite yet because it is so lightweight and it doesn't have any stickiness at all. I also love that the product includes skin loving ingredients like soothing chamomile and calming green tea extract, which is going to deliver a boost of skin benefits with every application. Next up, I'm trying out two Shine On Lip Jellies. You're going to get the shine of a gloss with the comfort of a balm plus a pop of color. So I got the color Chill, which is the clear. And then I got the spicy Sheerest Red Hot Hot Hot. The lip jellies do include a unique blend of five nourishing oils to soothe and protect the lips. Some of those oils are kernel oil, I see rosa canina fruit oil, raspberry seed oil, castor oil, and even avocado oil. I love both of these lip jellies. I can see myself using them every day in the summer because they are not too thick or too glossy. They're just the perfect amount of tint and gloss. Very comfortable to wear. Thank you all so much for watching. Please give me a like and subscribe if you want to see more videos like this. Until next time, bye!